Hello, forum members. Um, well, there's a lot of new people, and, uh, you know, they're getting kind of fed up with spending, like, 15 or $30 a week or $60 a month or whatever on pre-made factory-built coils. Uh, when they can build exactly the same number of coils for like less than two bucks. And uh, it seems to be a big scary deal to build a, you know, the first coil. So what I'm going to do is show you how to build a simple staple coil. And uh, what I've got here is an 8 inch piece of Canthal A1 24 gauge. Uh, this coil I'm building to 0 0.55 ohm resistance and the reason I'm doing that is uh, when you want to get a little fancier and use two of these it's going to come out to 0 0.275 ohms resistance but well, that's for later on uh, basically you're going to just do the same thing twice and 0 0.27 will work on pretty much any uh, regulated mod you want to use. As for mechanical mods, uh, you're on your own. Learn to build your coils first, learn your resistances, and learn your safe, safe zones. So, first thing we have the 8 inch length of 24 gauge Canthal A1, and we have the little blue screwdriver that comes in your kit with your rebuildable atomizer. <coughs> Now, I've already measured uh, the resistance using steamengine.org, and I know how many wraps I need to do. It takes seven wraps. So you're going to take one end of your wire, and you're going to pin it with your thumb to your screwdriver. And you take your other end, and you're going to wrap that as tightly as you can around the screwdriver seven times, that's three, that's four, five, six, seven, and we do one more, eight, and uh, eight inches of wire was a little bit too much, but that's okay. We can use that for the second one. You take that off your screwdriver, turn it around, put it back on. Now the reason we did eight wraps is because we didn't want a nice even coil, and the way we're going to get that is this scrappy end here, on, uh, scrappy leg here, this, this garbage coil at the end. We're going to pull that just one coil off. And just give that a little pull. And as you see, a little unwrapping, unwrap. And when you're done, your legs will be facing the same way. Straighten the legs a little bit. Take your wire cutters. Cut the excess. Pull it off. And there is a 0 0.55 ohm coil. You mount that to your atomizer um, and then tune it up. But that's for another day.